Hey guys, Chris Grove fishing here. Uh, beautiful Champlain in the backdrop. About ready to call it an evening. Caught a couple fish uh, for some photos. This is one thing I really, really want to stress and show some of you anglers. Fizzing. Proper way to fizz. Uh, we have to manage our species and take care of them. I don't care if you catch them in 6 feet of water or 50 feet of water. Chances are, in the summer, when you get water above that, you know, 75 degree mark and they you know they need to be fizzed uh, like i said i don't care if it's deep or shallow if he's showing signs of it you definitely have to uh first step is here this is just a simple three and three quarter pound fish i'll show you what he looks like in the live well he just went in here not even three minutes ago um see him he's he's kind of striving he's kind of working hard to get air there he goes down but most of the time he's laying on his side so i want to get him comfortable uh, for the weigh-in but even if you're fun fishing you gotta watch what's going on with the fish so i'm going to show you the proper ways couple couple different needles i like this one uh, a little longer air tube on it i could flex it um i do have a plunger for it because sometimes it gets filled with uh you know whether meat or a scale but uh here we go i'm going to show you how we do this boys and girls okay hopefully he's not too mad we don't want to lose that Oh, all right, all right, all right. First thing I can do is, I don't want to lose everything. Carpet decal, I, well, we're losing everything here. I like to put them on a carpet decal and get the carpet decal wet. If I can avoid the carpet, I'm gonna, okay? There we go, pop this so I don't lose it. Here's the name of the game. Simple, simple, simple. I put him between my legs and usually they're nice to me. Well, he's not gonna be. So this is simple, guys. Ah, 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 and he stabbed me, see? He did not like being in the live well, and he broke it off. Golly. Sorry. This ain't going as well as planned, but that's why we give it to you straight here. All right, so, simple, simple. You count down on his doors open. He's a little messed up. I go down five, okay? Hey, please. I go to the fifth. Then I line up with his anus and his pectoral fin, and I take the highest spot between the fifth, his side fin, and his anus. This is what we do. So I got the fifth, show him about right there. This is what I like to do. I like to, uh, he's not gonna like it. <laughs> but as you can see, he's a little higher there. That's his air sac. So I'm gonna lift up a, a, a scale, just like that, and make sure you go in sideways first, then plunge st straight down. So I'm in, now you're gonna go up, there goes his air, you don't wanna let it all out. Now take him back out, he's ready to go, he's calm and relaxed. You, the key thing though there was not to press all the air out. Watch with him. He's gonna get himself ready. Oh, bye, buddy. Straight down he goes. Right there, guys. Chris Girl Fishing, showing you guys how to fizz. Important part of our sport and keeping those smallmouth bass alive. You guys take care. There'll be more to come.